Hi, my name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and today I'm sharing a quick and easy recipe for no-bake caramel cookies. And as always, I'll make sure to leave the recipe in the description box. You are going to need granulated sugar, evaporated milk, semi-sweet chocolate chips, toffee bits, a pinch of salt, unsalted butter, instant butterscotch pudding, and oats. So let's get started. First, we're gonna start off by bringing our butter, which is already in the pot, our sugar, and our evaporated milk to a rolling boil over medium heat. So my mixture has come to a rolling boil, and a rolling boil is even when you're stirring the mixture, it still continues to boil. That's what a rolling boil is. So that's what I was looking for. And so now I'm going to remove it from the heat and I'll show you what comes next. All right, so now I'm going to add my dry pudding, my oats, and a little bit of salt. And I'm just gonna give this a good stir. And then I'm just gonna let it sit and uh, cool off for just a few minutes. So I've been letting my oat mixture cool for about seven minutes. Now I'm adding in my toffee bits and my chocolate chips. And you wanna gently fold in the chocolate chips because you don't want them to melt. You just want to gently incorporate them. All right, so I've got a large baking sheet here. It's actually one that I use for making bacon because it's so big. And all you're gonna do is just drop, uh, this is, I think is a one and a half tablespoon scoop that I'm using. You're just gonna drop a scoop of the oat mixture on there, kind of flatten it out a little bit. And you're just gonna let these cool completely. So here are the cookies. I let them sit for about an hour and they were completely set. The recipe says that you can sprinkle some salt on top if you'd like, but I did not do that. I skipped that step. So I hope you all enjoyed this simple and delicious no-bake cookie. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, we'd certainly love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.